My name is George Osodi, and uh, I'm a photographer from Nigeria, and I'm based in Lagos. My work generally focuses a lot on uh, issues. I like photographing issue-related subjects, especially um, issues that confront us as Africans, and uh, West Africa most precisely, and then Nigeria, of course, where I come from. Um, the region is such a dynamic region full of energy, um, life, you know, people, diverse culture. Growing up as a kid, I rem remember trying to do some research, um, you know, looking at African images and um, especially Nigerian images. Uh, majority that I saw were actually shot by Europeans or uh, Westerners. So when I became a photographer, I had to take that up as a challenge to also document the life time that I lived at uh, the moment. I was determined because I, I, I had wanted to really, really document Africa, uh, document Nigeria especially, so that people around the country will really get to appreciate their region. And I felt as a photographer, it was important that I, I make images of this situation, of this drama. I was very interested in taking pictures that I would show to the Nigerian people about what's happening in their backyard. That was a big drive for me because I, a lot of people hear so much about the Delta region, the conflict, the oil conflict, the, the oil pollution, the injustice. You know, a lot, uh, the people, the culture. But like I said, people don't really know how it looks like, but they hear so much about it. I mean, I mean, Nigerians, you know, in general. So it was a big challenge for me to travel to the region, you know, different villages, taking photographs of this new found gold, so to speak, you know, and the impact of oil in the lives of the people and the community and in the environment. It was quite risky, uh, I must say, but uh, and then I had a lot of challenges um, on how to represent these images. Some images I took were so graphic, so gory, and not everyone could handle it, and that would drive people away from the image. So but as I grew, as I learned more and um, developed myself more, I realized that people love things that are beautiful. And it's easier to attract attention when something is beautiful. So that was one of the skills I adopted in my early days in photography. And tried to take images that are very beautiful and very attractive. And then by so doing, you get someone's attention to the image. And of course, when he comes closer, he realizes that there's something actually behind him. It's the reason why this image was shot, and he gets to see it. But this time, it's too late. You can't run away from the image, because you've been dragged into it. So yes, that uh, was how I started photographing the Delta region, with the aim of documenting the region for posterity, for Nigerians to, have, to see what's happening in the country. The project gained a much more global prominence. And since then, it's been traveling all over the world. And there's been this huge attention um, attached to the project.